Hi, I'm Emma. I'm 10 years old and I've been in remission. I have ulcerative colitis and I've been in remission for the past nine and a half months thanks to fecal transplant. Emma, can you explain what is fecal transplant? Fecal transplant is when, my, is when the donor poops in a hat and blends it together with saline or something and puts it in an enema and gives it to the person who has the bowel disease through the rectum. When you and your family were considering fecal transplant, what were your treatment options? Um, I was either going to be going on Remicade or have a colectomy, which is when you get your colon out. And what medications were you taking? I was taking 6-MP, allopurinol, prednisone, sulfasalazine, prevacid, and canassa suppositories. And why did your family choose fecal transplant before trying Remicade? I didn't really, the truth is I didn't really want to go to the hospital to get, to get IV meds. And what were your symptoms when you were considering fecal transplant? I was tired, I had stomach aches, I, I had diarrhea, I was going up to 11 times a day, and it was filled with blood. And how did your symptoms change after fecal transplant? Within 24 hours, uh, all my system symptoms were gone. No blood, I was pooping less, it felt great. Are you glad you tried fecal transplant? Yes, totally. What are you able to do now that you weren't able to do when you were really sick? As I said, when I was really sick, I was really tired. So now I can run and jump and play and do all the sports I did. And what medications are you taking now? Sulfasalazine and the, and the vitamin that goes with it, folic acid. Do you have any dietary restrictions? Any foods that you can't eat? Um, my parents don't like to eat. We have to be careful. Um, eat. We have to be careful eating out places. I can't eat fried food or liquid dairy or anything greasy. And what happens if you eat something greasy now? My parents are just too scared to try it. Does it hurt to get the enema? No, it may feel a little bit weird, but that's it. Does it hurt when you're trying to retain the enema or hold it in? If I haven't pooped that morning, it may, fe it may feel a little bit hard to hold it in, but nothing. And what do you do while you are retaining the enema? If it's your first time, you should do some different exercises to help move the stool around the colon, around your colon, but I just go about my normal day. Do you think that fecal transplant is gross? Not really. I don't really think about it that much, but since my mom prepares it in the bathroom that writes, that's right next to, my, to the bedroom, it kind of smells. <laughs> Would you say, what would you say to other people who are considering fecal transplant? I would say, go for it. It's another opportunity to get well again. And it's better than some other things that you could do. Why are you pressing?